Dave Chappelle was attacked on stage during his comedy show at the Netflix is a Joke Festival on Tuesday night. Access Hollywood confirms. According to NBC Los Angeles, the incident occurred toward the end of Chappelle's performance at the Hollywood Bowl when a man in a black hoodie rushed the stage. Per the outlet, the man appeared to push the 48-year-old comedian, which knocked him to the ground. The suspect then attempted to run away, but was stopped by security guards and members of Chappelle's team and taken into custody. A spokesperson for the Los Angeles Police Department told Access Hollywood that the man was armed with a replica gun that ejects a knife blade if discharged correctly. The LAPD confirmed neither Dave nor any law enforcement officers were injured, but that the suspect was taken to the hospital for injuries and to also be evaluated. Authorities identified the suspect on Wednesday morning as 23-year-old Isaiah Lee and are charging him with felony assault with a deadly weapon, Access confirms. His bail has been set at $30,000. Access Hollywood has reached out to Chappelle's reps and the Hollywood Bowl for further comment. Several other A-listers at the event sprung into action to defend their friend, including Jamie Foxx and Chris Rock, who performed earlier in the night. According to video from audience member Sean Azari and obtained by NBC News, Rock was among those who tended to Chappelle, and the two appeared to be in good spirits after the incident, sharing smiles and a handshake before Rock took the mic to deliver a zinger. Was that Will Smith? The one-liner referenced the now infamous moment when Smith slapped Rock on stage at the Oscars in March after the comedian made a joke about Smith's wife, Jada Pinkett Smith. Jada, I love you. G.I. Jane 2, can't wait to see it. All right? <laughs> <laughs> it's, that, was a, that was a nice one. Okay. I'm out here. Uh-oh. Richard. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. Will Smith did the King Richard star released a statement apologizing to Rock the following day, saying in part, I would like to publicly apologize to you, Chris. I was out of line and I was wrong. I am embarrassed and my actions were not indicative of the man I want to be. There is no place for violence in a world of love and kindness. The Academy later announced its decision to bar Smith from all events and programs related to the organization, including the Oscars, for 10 years. Though Chris has stayed mostly quiet about the incident, other comedians have shown him their support. At the 2022 Grammys, Chelsea Handler shared with Access Hollywood why she's applauding her friend and colleague for his response to the situation. I think Chris just handled himself perfectly, you know? I think he really kind of set an example for how one should handle themselves in that situation. Um, he's a pro, and uh, he definitely didn't deserve anything like that to happen. Uh, but I respect him even more than I did before, which was a lot. So uh, I am just kind of proud to see how he handled that. Yeah, yeah. How would you have handled it if you were hosting? Well, if I got smacked in the face, <laughs> I mean, I don't know how I would have handled that. I can't even imagine. I would have been in shock. Um, I don't think I would have been able to uh, come back as, as quickly as he did and carry on. But who knows? You know, you never know how you're going to react in a situation like that. Right. Well, if you were hosting, because I follow you on Instagram, I feel like you would have come out with like probably topless with something on you know your like pineapples on yeah, your keep chest your hands <laughs> off my face if you want to hit something yeah. they're right here that's what i would have said i feel like i know you guys are all talking about that but yeah